So in this example, we have a very complex file, a lot of CMYK, RGB graphics, uh, transparencies, fine text, and so on and so forth. And a file like this is usually a challenge for digital printers to print. But digital printers using Fiery Job Expert, this is no longer a challenge. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up a command workstation. I'm going to process and hold this just with standard settings. And please keep in mind that uh, Fiery Job Expert runs on external Fiery's running FS400 software. So now we're going to preview the results with the standard features turned on aside of the original. And you're going to see it's not even close. So in this case, a lot of times the operator will then re-rip this job, go back into the properties of the job, and try to turn options on and off to fix this problem. But what we can do is we can remove the raster here and apply job expert to analyze the file. And what this will do is this will turn on or off job properties in the file to give us the best output. So after we're done running that, we'll review the report from Fiery Job Expert. You're going to see it's going to show the operator all the different options inside of job properties that were turned on or off to get the best output possible. So after we review this list, we can then hit show preview and this will show us the results for each option turned on and the elements it affected in the file. So in this example here, text quality and graphics, we affected those small font at the bottom. If we go to the next option, PDF print engine preferred, we affected these elements in the file. All right? Let's go to the next option, composite overprint. You can see we affected these elements in the file. So you get the idea. We actually will go in and show you everything that is being affected by using Job Expert. So now if we do a process and hold on this job again, and we look at a preview, you're going to see that the printed result is pretty much in line with what the designer's intent was when they created this file.